Good morning, class. Welcome to school. I'm your teacher, Mr. Wise, and you are my wiggle worms. Mr. Wise's wiggle worms. Can you wiggle your little worm finger and say, good morning, Mr. Wise? Good morning, Mr. Wise. <laughs> Thank you, class. Well, it's time for me to find out if all of my preschoolers are here today. Marcus is here. Hmm, Diamond is here. But where's preschooler Peyton? I don't see her anywhere. I'm right here, Mr. Wise. Oh, well, hello, preschooler Peyton. I'm so glad you're here today. Now, to speed things up, why don't the rest of you just yell out your names to me on the count of three. Ready? One, two, two three. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, got it. I'm so glad you all are here. Before we get started, I need to tell you all about our classroom rules. We have two simple rules in our class. Rule number one is to be kind. Let me see you all hold up one finger and say, be kind. Be, be kind. kind. Good job, boys and girls. We can be kind by making sure we stay in our seats so that everyone in the class can see. <coughs> yes, Peyton, do you have a question? Yes, sir. I thought of another way to be kind. We can be kind by not talking when someone else is talking. You are exactly right, Peyton. If you think you can be kind by staying in your seat and not talking when someone else is talking, let me see you put one finger over your lips and say, shh, shh. Okay, great job. Our second rule is to be safe. Hold up two fingers and say, be safe. Be, be safe. safe. Good job, boys and girls. We can be safe by keeping our hands in our laps. If you can keep your hands in your lap, then do this with me. Clap, clap. Clap, clap, and put them in your lap. Great job, guys. In Mr. Wise's class, I want all of you all to be wise, too. You can be wise when you listen and learn. I have a fun song that will help us do this. Stand up and sing it with me. Wise people listen. Wise people learn. Proverbs 1-5. Wiggle like a wise. This is how we do it. do it. Spin, spin, spin. Let's get to, get it. to it. Hop, hop, hop. This is how we do it. Do it. Spin, spin, spin. Let's get to it. Wise people listen. Wise people learn. Uh -huh. Proverbs 1 5. Wiggle like a worm. Hop, hop, hop. This is how we do it. Do it. Spin Let's get to, get to it. Hop, hop, hop. This is how we do it. Do it. Spin, spin, spin. Let's get to, get to it. it. Wise people listen. Wise people learn. Proverbs 1 5. Wiggle like a worm. Yeah! That was so fun. You can sit back down in your seats because it's time for us to get ready for our class party. Woo! 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 All right. Now, preschooler Peyton, can you and the rest of our class put on your party hats like this? Yep. Awesome. Those hats are great. Now, let me see you all hold up your party horns and say, doop, da da doop. Doop, da da doop. Now let's put our party horns in our pockets and wait until we get outside of the playground before we blow them again. Now, I'm going to pass out the party treats do, Peyton's mom do, sent in. Do, 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 da, da, do. Preschooler do, Peyton, do, do. make sure you listen and obey by putting your party horn away, okay? Oh, Thank Mr. you. Mr. Wise, I'm not going to put my horn away. I'm going to play music on my horn all day. It's so fun. I know it's fun, but right now it is time for you to obey and put our horns away. You know, our class pet, Willie Worm, had trouble obeying the other day, too. So he wiggled himself right into a Bible story that helped him learn how to wise up. I'm sure you won't mind coming out of his little hole in the ground to tell us about it. On the count of three, everybody say, where's Willie Worm? Ready? One, two, three. Where's, where's Willie Worm? Worm? Hey there, friends. The other day, I was having trouble obeying Daddy Worm. I know that the Bible always has wise words, so I wiggled around in there until I found a Bible story that helped me know what to do when I don't want to obey. Let's get ready to see the story by putting on our special eyes. Zoop, zoop! Great! 
Now let's get ready to listen by clicking on our listening ears. Click, click. Now you're ready. When I wiggled around in the Bible, I found this story about Josiah. Can you say Josiah? Josiah. Josiah became king when he was only eight years old. The kings before Josiah did not love and obey God, but Josiah did love God. Let me hear you shout, I love you, God. I love you, God. One way Josiah showed love to God was by obeying him and cleaning the temple. Josiah's workers cleaned God's temple from top to bottom. Friends, let me see you pretend to sweep. Good job! While they were cleaning, the workers found a scroll of God's word. They quickly took the scroll to King Josiah. He read the words very carefully. Let me see you pretend to read like King Josiah. King Josiah told all the people to come hear God's word so they would know how to obey God. After reading all the words out loud to the people, Josiah said, I will obey God. God wants you and me to obey him every day too. Let me hear you say this after me. I will. I will. Obey. Obey. God. God. Great. Well, that's all I have for today. But before I go, would you like to do the wiggle worm dance with me? Yes! Then hold up your little wiggle worm finger and make it move as we sing. I'm a little wiggle worm, watch me go. I can wiggle fast and I can wiggle slow. I wiggle all around, then back I go. Down into the ground, to the home I know. Bye-bye, friends! Bye-bye, Willie. Willie sure is a silly worm, isn't he? Yes. Mr. Wise, I'm so sorry for not obeying you. Willie Worm's story from the Bible helped me know that I need to wise up and obey. I'll put my horn right here in my pocket. Thank you. God wants us to obey him and obey others. When we wise up and obey, it makes God so happy. Class, let me hear you say this after me. I will. I will. Obey. Obey. God. God. Great job. One way we can wise up and obey God is by reading his words in the B-I-B-L-E. That spells Bible. Can you spell that with me? B. B. I. I. B. B. L. L. E. E. Now, let's stand up and sing that together. Okay, class, you can all have a seat one more time. Have you had fun at school today? Yes, today has been so much fun, and I can't wait to finish our party. Before we move on, can you tell me what you learned today? I learned so much. I learned that God wants me to wise up and obey. I will obey God today and every day. I can't wait to tell my family what I learned today. That's a great idea. Well, Wiggle Worms, this is our last week together. I hope you've had so much fun learning how to wise up this year in school. 
Bye-bye. Bye-bye.